What's up guys? Adam Clark here at Adam Clark Fitness. And I don't know if you've noticed lately, if you follow our page, we've been doing a lot more videos. Uh, we're doing some Facebook Lives, some videos, trying to make it more interactive. And hopefully uh, you've been enjoying it. Uh, today, uh, I'm doing a little video called Five Healthy Grocery Hacks That Save You Money. Right? So, of course we want to save money, especially at the grocery store. So this not only, not only, excuse me, I can't even talk, will not only save you time, uh, but money and also help you uh, reach your health and fitness goals. And it's all about grocery shopping. So number one, we, we already know we need to make a list, right? You don't go in blind. You need to shop the perimeter of the store. That's very important. And eat before you go grocery shopping um, so you don't buy a bunch of extra stuff. Uh, but our five hacks, here they are. Are you ready? Good. Hack number one um, really has something um, you can do before you hit the stores or even uh, finalize your list, and that's open up your cupboards, open up your fridge, and just see what's, uh, what's in there that isn't any good anymore or also something that you're never going to eat. Right? You know we always get those items that we think at the time they're going to be great, but we don't end up eating them. So clear that space out. Um, and that can help you plan your meals to know what you have. Um, because number one, last thing you want to do, thinking you have fresh vegetables in the fridge and they're not fresh, right? Then you get home, you can't make the recipe. And number two, you need room in the fridge. Okay, so I just do a quick inventory uh, before you hit the grocery store. Number two, uh, use a small cart if possible. So I know Hannaford, they have the smaller carts. Um, so use that smaller car because um, that that makes you not want to impulse buy as much. If you have that big cart and you got got items in there, there's there's more room for for impulse. But if it's full with all your uh, healthy foods, you're you're less apt to do that. Number three, uh, it goes back to kind of when we took our inventory. Uh, remember that food you tossed from your fridge or. Um, you know, did it include any produce? Did it include any veggies? Um, so when you're shopping for, for produce, um, you, you know what you need, right? Um, another thing, you know, if you, if you have an idea, you know, it sounds good, this giant bunch of kale, but you're constantly throwing it out. For me, it's celery, right? I think I'm going to eat all this celery, then I don't. You know, maybe if I just cut down that portion, I would, so I don't waste it. So the hack really here is to, to buy only what you really need, um, not what you, um, what you aspire to need, right? We don't necessarily need that uh, big thing of uh, kale, even though it's good for you. But buy the smaller bag or buy fewer items. Uh, next is just be an informed buyer. Um, guys, think of this. In grocery stores, these, these food companies, they, they are marketing companies, right? They're marketing companies, and that's... You know, why at the end caps they're paying top dollar to be on those end caps, right? Because that's where um, they can make the money, right? On the end caps, everyone sees them. So number one, don't look at the end caps. Just keep motoring on by. Um, those are the tempting items, usually a lot of the unhealthy stuff. Um, and, and really just keep an eye on a lot of stuff is at eye level, right? That's that's the stuff that may be a little bit more expensive. They pay a little bit more money to be on that top shelf. Look a little lower. Um, you might find some healthy items and also some um, less expensive items. Then the last one. So this is the last one. This is a money thing. Um, pay with cash. Um, I know that you know. I listen to a lot of Dave Ramsey stuff, and he's all about cash, and it's so true. When you hand over that cash, it really makes a difference other, you know, compared to the swipe. Um, so pay with the cash because you really feel that. And that helps you also set those priorities and what you really need. Um, so really, guys, those are our five grocery hacks. Um, what one really appeals to you? I know that uh, we've all been guilty of, of those impulse buys um, and, you know, buying excess kale or whatever vegetable it may be. Uh, but what what uh, what speaks to you? Uh, what did you learn from this? We'd love to hear from you below. I hope this helps you uh, not only streamline your grocery trip, grocery trip, but uh, save you some money. Um, and also, if you if you ever need help, you know we're here for you at Adam Clark Fitness. Uh, we 
we teach healthy habits and we'd love to have you. Um, if you'd love to try out a session, let us know. Comment below or send us a message. Uh, we'll talk to you again soon and, and can't wait to bring you another one of these videos. Bye guys.